Something I never understood about Death Note is that What's up YouTube, my name is Julian and today we have another video for the series of analysis and reactions. Today I will be reacting to Death Note's openings and endings and I want to thank you very very freaking much because we are almost at 800 subscribers. It's very crazy considering that I started doing this series like two weeks ago and I'm so grateful for you for all the amazing information you give me and insight about the anime industry. Feel absolutely free to like, comment or subscribe. It helps me a lot to reach new people with these analysis and reactions. And let's get into this. Before starting, I want to clarify that I already watched Death Note, I don't know, more than 10 years ago. I want to be honest with you, uh, but I don't remember any of the openings and endings. I don't know if I ever watched them, but I wanted to tell you that, to be completely honest. And let's start. What those kids? Oh, I love that every instrument of the band is so active right now the bass doing some crazy feels going up and down can you hear it? and the guitar is doing ah, this rhythmic pattern is beautiful man oh crap Oh, oh, this is my shit, man. We have some keyboards doing this organ like effect. It's like an organ, but um, I don't know. It's high pitch, but it's timber. is a, a little bit, I don't know how to say it. Crystalline, <laughs> maybe. Everything having so much activity, the guitars doing some octaves. Oh. oh, beautiful stops again. The voice from the singer is. Oh. With supporting vocals, okay. Oh, this opening is hype, dude. The face is beautiful, man. Oh, those stops, dude. <laughs> that is top tier metal stops here. Oh, how was it? Yeah, like tam ta dam tam tam ta da tam. Oh, I love it because it's a stop, like I already said. And sometimes you need that to to stop. To continue giving more hype to the song, more energy, like in the chorus, I presume it's going to be. Let me see. Yeah, it's probably that the chorus is the same melody from the beginning. Oh, oh the guitar is going crazy, dude. Oh, oh. Oh, dude. Don't give your hand to that guy! Don't do it! Girl, I already forgot her name. Misa, Misa. Oh, oh man. <laughs> I didn't remember that at all, dude. And it's fucking great. So much energy, so much things happening. Wow, no wonder that note was this successful, dude. Next one. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that motherfucker's face, dude. Oh, oh dude, these openings are <laughs> oh. masterpieces. The power, the power, and the, and the corruption, <laughs> as in the anime. <laughs> That grow. Oh, 
<laughs> yeah, you're laughing like, huh? Oh, dude, I like it because everything builds up around these motifs. That one, that. That, that, that. What, how it is? That's the main motive of the song. Even here, the bass, the drums, the guitar again, and, and the voice. It's madness, man. Oh. <laughs> oh dude and it's amazing that that this grows this heavy 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 part of the singing is is kind of of a rap uh, a grow metalish rap well this part also the blending from ultra heavy metal and rap Whoa. I'm telling you, dude, I'm telling you. Oh. I'm telling you that the that the intensity drop needs to be part of a song almost all of, all the time. Because if the song is all the time here or hearing intensity, it won't hype you enough, it won't transmit you enough. So we are having all this madness all along the song, along the way. And we have a drop of activity, of intention, of everything, of dynamics. It's very soft and it starts to build up. Each time louder, now the snare comes in. Each time harder, heavier, and the voice is also heavier each time. <laughs> Dude, this describes Death Note so well, from visuals uh, to the madness and chaos of the of the song of the music. Look at this, this is what what's happening on Light's mind. Exactly that, it's broken, dude. Something I never understood about Death Note is that they say that um, the users of the Death Note are possessed, right? By Shinigamis, but was Light possessed? We were watching him doing everything out of his free will and Ryuk didn't do anything to, to convince him. Did he? Wow. Kind of emotional. That glitch in Light's face. Was Light a good or a bad person? Debate open. I love <laughs> that even in, in rock Japanese it's put so much emotion and drama. Oh, the piano man! Beautiful! All of this is so beautiful. The, the strange thing here is that Japanese people in real life are often... Well, I haven't talked to many of them or none, but I have this image of them being so serious and not that emotional or showing their feelings. So this, this contrast is interesting. Maybe because they aren't allowed to show their feelings in, in real life, they end up doing this amazing 
uh, music and art. And this song gives me vibes of like light repentance. Oh, so evil. Maybe the, the human part of him here, maybe that's what the creators wanted to show here. That he's still a human and, and have feelings and remorse, but maybe the possession, maybe, I don't know, getting that far and having that kind of power in your hands is, is something none of us would comprehend, never. Okay, this hits harder. Da -da -da. Da -da -da. You can hear that da -da being synchronized from the snare of the drums and the guitar and it's actually a pretty common motif in, in I don't remember but in, in rock and roll I think <laughs> in the early rock and roll like that song that that is like Para tada tada Don't Oh no, don't do that. <laughs> Don't do this! Wow, I love th that the first part of the verse is a beautiful distortion guitar, but mm, kind of gentle, kind of arpeggiated. To the better, to the better, better, better. Oh, it's comping so good. Oh, I like the subdivision, the rhythmic consciousness of the singer is is, is amazing, it's really really good. He's doing doing that is spinning a little bit the subdivisions of the melodic line and wow. It's amazing good. And now the guitar is doing another thing. More standard. Okay. Give me the freaking breakdowns and the clean voice. Oh, what a chorus! Oh, oh, that chorus is like ascending a little bit. Oh, dude. Oh, what? Oh, this ending is. Oh, I wanna be headbanging to this. No, not again. Oh, or yes, again. Oh, I'm gonna be headbanging to this so much, dude. If you got this far on the video, thank you for being here. Share this video with friends, family, whatever person you think that can enjoy this kind of content, this kind of musical inside analysis reaction. And next, we'll have a little bit of Vinland Saga. Probably even today, we'll have Double Drop. See you.